Hello everyone, let us work out the circle theorem question. And once again we have a diagram and we are asked to find the measure of four angles with reasons to support our answers. So let's start with part one and we are finding ADC. Let's first locate the angle. Going from A to D to D to C means that the angle is located here at D, which is the middle letter. And we are using a theorem. The angle subtended by a diameter in a semicircle is 90 degrees. So this is the diameter here in blue. And this is a semicircle here in blue again. And this is an angle subtended by the diameter this angle here by D. So D must be 90 degrees by this theorem. So angle ADC equal 90 degrees. Let's move on to part 2 now. Angle ACD, let's look for this angle, it's going from A to C and then to D this is the angle here that we want, this angle here in blue, so let's see how to find that. Well, we have a straight line here, and a straight line has 180 degrees in it. So we can find this angle over here, which is 180 minus 72, which is 108 degrees. So let's see that a straight line has 180 degrees. Okay, so therefore 180 subtract 72 would be 108 degrees. Now we must observe that this triangle OCD has two radii as lengths and therefore two of the lengths are equal meaning these two angles at the base here are also equal. This is an isosceles triangle. So we want to write OCD is isosceles. So let us say 180 subtract 108 is equal to 72. And then let us divide 72 by 2 to get 36. So therefore, this is equal to angle ACD. Answer for part 2. Let's look at part 3. We want to find angle CAD. Going from C to A and then to D. We have this angle here, CAD. And we know the value of C to be 36. We know the value of D to be 90. Now we have to find this angle. So let us say 180 subtract 36 plus 90 which is 180 subtract 126 which will get 54 degrees our answer for CAD that's our answer for part 3 Part 4 now, we have to find OEA, so let's identify that angle from O to E to A, is this angle here, okay, how do we find this angle, well, we know that O is 72 degrees, and we have to find this angle, 
So there's a theorem that we can use. A tangent to a circle is perpendicular to the radius at the point of contact. So this is our tangent in red. This is our radius in red. And where they meet must form a 90 degree angle. So therefore we know the value of two angles in the triangle. A 90 degree and a 70, 72 degree. So let's say 180. Take away 72 plus 90. Which is 180. Take away 162. Which is 18 degrees. Okay, so angle OEA. equal to 18 degrees 18 and those are our answers thanks for watching and all the best to you